Sport capturing the attention of the North Korean regime, and it's not basketball, it's pro wrestling. And an international competition is being held this weekend in Pyongyang. Some observers see it as an attempt to boost relations with the U.S. and Japan through sports diplomacy. Our Kim Min Bin explains. Several athletes arrive at Pyongyang Airport. They're all pro wrestlers here to take part in an international wrestling competition. There are some familiar faces, such as Bob Sapp and Jerome Lee Banner, who are well known in the wrestling world. But all eyes are on Japan's wrestler turned politician, Antonio Inoki. I believe this event will be successful. I hope it serves as a stepping stone for international peace. The head of North Korea's International Olympic Committee, Chang Ung, greeted the athletes upon their arrival. North Korean state media has been extensively promoting the competition, airing previews and detailed introductions. North Korean leader Kim Jong Un is known to take advantage of sports diplomacy to promote his country, but some experts say this could be a means to enhance relations with Japan. As Inoki had a meeting with the secretary of the Central Committee of the Workers' Party of Korea, Kang Sok Chu, experts believe he might also be acting as a go-between for the Japanese government. The pro wrestling event comes as two nations look to improve bilateral ties, especially by dealing with the issue of Japanese nationals kidnapped by North Korean agents in the 1970s and 80s. Seoul-based Yonhap News reported, quoting diplomatic sources in Tokyo, that the two countries face difficulties in making progress in their government-level talks. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.